Om Shanti, welcome back to your own channel. See the soul, the truth lies within. And now we're going to talk over the 7th March of our quarterly blessing, where Supreme Father is asking us to remember all the attainments which we have received from Him directly. So the world thinks about the attainments in the terms of financial attainment, physical attainments, that is worldly attainments. But God says, I am a source of peace. I am a source of love, I am a source of purity, I am a source of happiness, bliss. And I give you all of that by first giving you the knowledge about you. That means about us. Because when a child forgets himself, then he forgets the creator too. So we souls, we have been here for a very long time. We have left the supreme abode, have come down on this earth, have spent a long time and we have forgotten where we came from who we actually are, what are we supposed to do on this earth and when all that is forgotten then our acting on this earth because we souls are actors on this earth then our acting becomes impure or instead of becoming a hero actor we start becoming a villain actor. So then God says that you have attained a lot by getting this knowledge. Remember those attainments. Let's see, let's explore it. Baba says may you keep all your attainments in front of you. We have attained peace, love, happiness, but before that, we have attained the knowledge about the self, we have attained the knowledge about our previous births, we have attained the knowledge about how different religions come, why they come, what is our purpose, when are we all souls supposed to go back home to the supreme abode, to Godfather the abode, or what we call it as Param Dham, Parlok, or we call it as Heavenly Godfather's abode where he lives. We all souls have to leave our bodies and go back. When will that happen? That is also the knowledge which we have attained that makes us more and more stronger and powerful. And God says, and stay in your elevated pride and thereby become a master almighty authority. God is almighty authority. We being his children, when we get to know his creation, how he has created, then we become master almighty authority then no situation can make us feel weak or make us become shakable. Let's explore. All of us are most elevated souls, children of God, the highest on high. This pride is the most elevated pride. What more can one think? Somebody thinks I'm a child of a prime minister, I'm a child of a rich business person, I'm the child of a minister. And that person or that soul may feel proud. But I am a child of Supreme Godfather, which is a permanent title, is the highest and the most powerful title in the whole world. Don't you think so? So God says, those who stay seated on the seat of this elevated pride, this thought never become distressed. This pride of Brahmins, Brahmins means those who have taken this knowledge from Brahma or Adam, via supreme godfather those this pride of brahmins is even more elevated why because brahmins have the whole knowledge of how god has created the whole drama that's why they are proud about it not egoistic but proud with pure pride why because they are able to help other souls to become peaceful and stable in their mind with this knowledge so that is the pure pride then baba says keep a list of all your attainments in front of you knowledge peace, purity, drama has been explained to us, director, producer, godfather has explained how the mind works, how the intellect works, how to make it stable, all that knowledge is being shared with us. Then Baba says, keep a list of all your attainments in front of you and your elevated pride will then always be in your awareness. You will continue to sing the song, I have attained what I wanted to attain. And then there is nothing remaining to attain in this world. The worldly attractions are nothing in front of godly attractions. So then by having the awareness of all your attainments, you will easily make your stage that of a master almighty authority. But if we forget the knowledge, we forget about what God has taught us in Brahma Kumaris, we forget the seven day learning which we have received and we don't take anymore teaching and education after the seven day course then we become more shakable and small small situations will bring us into distress and we become more and more stressful because of leaving the godly education so 
even you are most welcome to take the seven day course and then follow along after the seven day course and become more stable and powerful and may all the secrets be revealed to you slowly by supreme godfather through the medium of brahma kumaris with this om shanti